Here's the Vector 3.2 Alpha. It's our latest in the speed generating fin line. An original design from 2006 where we won a SEMO award for it. It has a Vector foil. It's got a three degree cam, two degree toe in. Both those design aspects feel like it pulls you through the turn and has this weird ability to, to feel like you just, you come out of the turn with more speed than you went into it so that it sets you up for the next turn and on and on and on. It's a, it's a real unique feel and every, all the feedback that uh, we've gotten from this one has been super positive so far. Right now, as far as our line go, it is the epitome of a experiential fin. So you can put it on the same board and get a new feeling. The features of the, the Vector 3.2 Alpha, the first thing you'll notice is the cutoff tip. Slightly different template in the center fin than the side fin and the, they both have cutoff tips. Um, the cutoff tip was something we originally did in, a, in the Scimitar back in 2006 was part of the series that won the award. When we started designing or redesigning this 3.2 fin as we laid in the foils and and started to work out the details and the design elements of the fin, the cutoff tip really flowed nicely with the foils. And because of the enhanced water attachment, we wanted the, the cutoff tip as a design element that helps the, the fin break free when you want it to. The next design element is in the side fin. It actually has two cants within the fin. There's the six and, six and a half degrees which is the standard cant that you'll have on most all thruster fins. When it comes out of the board, it comes out at six and a half degrees. And about midway through the fin, we have a break in it where we cant another three degrees. That's where the three comes from in the, the Vector 3.2. This is a, is a feature that enhances the rollover from rail to rail. And it also sets up a nice platform for the two in the 3.2. The two is an extra two degrees of toe in and normally your thruster side fin is set on the board and towed in at about a standard of about three degrees. Well in the 3-2 fin we actually halfway up the fin where the the extra can is we actually tow the foils in another two degrees which enhances the turn and also decreases the drag in the turn which is why we say it helps intermediate surfers connect and carry speed from turn to turn. In saying that, the foil is, is, is a bit different too. The foil is a vector foil. So this is something that's uh, been around in the Futures design for close to 20 years. And, and again, it's for enhancing the, the water attachment and really pulling you through the turns. And so that's the third element is that it's got a really refined, deep vector foil all the way through the fin from the base of the fin to the tip of the fin. So we talk a lot about water attachment. Without water attachment, you wouldn't get any thrust off your fin. Uh, water attachment's critical for you to, to make the turn, for you to initiate the turn, to pull through the turn, and to gain speed through the turn. Um, having that water attachment is what creates the, the, different, the force and the different uh, pressure, the high pressure and the low pressure. Enhancing that water, water attachment is is the key to a really good fin. So one of the tools that we use to refine this fin that we didn't have 20 years ago was computational fluid dynamics. And that's where we actually make a model of the fin and we put it into a virtual water tank, run water across it, virtual water across it, and we calculate the forces that are generated by running the water across the foil. And so we get to see the pressure difference, we get to see where the pressure is, and we also can run it through different angles in the turn and identify where in the fin is working the most at the different angles of attack. Angles of attack meaning what direction the water is flowing at the fin. We work with a company called Red Fluid. It's really enhanced and gave us a lot of confidence in what we're doing and how we design. It puts numbers on the forces that are created and the difference between the different foils and the difference between the different templates and also what happens to the bottom of the board when we move the fin around. It's just been a real key tool in uh, the latest designs that Futures is coming out with. Mm -hmm.